Hey everyone, and welcome to this week's Rights Ramblings. Um, as you notice, today is the first time I've actually worn my cowboy hat. Um, I'm wearing it today because I get a lot of questions about where my brand came from. Um, so I figured only appropriate to wear the hat on the day that I explain the story. Um, so the hat actually kind of came as an accident. Um, I was doing a personal photo shoot, something just for fun, and I was wearing my cowboy hat and my boots because it's part of my personality. You know, I'm, I'm really a country girl at heart. Um, when the pictures came back, one of the pictures was me smiling with the cowboy hat, and I absolutely loved the picture. It was a great representation of who I was. It was fun, um, and so I decided to use it as my social media avatar for Twitter and Facebook and LinkedIn. Um, after I put it up, I got a lot of great responses. People really liked the photo, um, and about six months later, I had started wearing the hat to a few of more my events, and people began to recognize me. Well, fast forward now a year and a half later, and the hat has become synonymous with who I am and my brand. Um, that has also been accomplished because I have taken it a step further. I've incorporated it now into my website, my business cards, and I've incorporated the, the personality, the wood background, the colorful post-its um, into all of my themes as well. And so my suggestion to you is that you need to create your own brand. What someone else does isn't going to work for everyone. And, and if wearing a hat isn't part of your personality, then don't wear a hat. But find something that fits who you are and then create your brand. Um, in the comments today, I'd love to hear a little bit about who you are and how you think you can turn that into a brand. Or if you've already created a brand, I'd love to know what that is and why you chose to go with that. Um, as always, I will see you next week. Bye!